All right, room seven and room 13. I just want to do a quick review of two different kinds of patterns that you might notice in some of the images of today's math activity. So remember, patterns are all about things repeating. And so the most basic pattern or kind of pattern is a repeating pattern. And that's where the core duplicates. So I'm circling the core of this pattern, this pattern blocks right now with my cursor. And you'll notice that this exact core is repeated just below it. And so we have two, two chunks that have repeated, and we can predict that this final chunk will repeat in the exact same way. So we call this a repeating pattern. If we scroll up, we're going to notice something called a growing pattern or an increasing pattern. Again, in a pattern, something always stays the same. In a growing pattern or an increasing pattern, something is added to in a strategic expected way. So you can see the red trapezoid block along the bottom where my cursor is, is the foundation. What's being added? A square. Another orange square, another orange square, another. So we call this an increasing or growing pattern. Likewise, if you flip this image around and went this way to this way, you could have a decreasing pattern. So this would be described as a growing or an increasing pattern, looking at it in this manner. Oh yes, and before I exit, now down to some pictures. Now this, what is it? It's a bumblebee with honeycombs. And what do we see here? Well, I've already told you, it's a repeating pattern. And I'm gonna give you a little more clue. It's repeating these honeycombs, which are like hexagon shapes, because the shape or the core keeps repeating without changing. So the shape of the honeycomb stays the same. There's just more of them. So this would be a repeating pattern. Now if we come down here to this picture, this is a fern leaf. Now, what's foundational? We have a stem with leaves growing off of it, right? But what is changing? This one could actually be described as an increasing or decreasing pattern. If we look at it from this way, the leaves are getting bigger. So this would be increasing. If we start over here, actually where it grows, and we look at the leaves, the new growth is actually coming out smaller. And soon these leaves will grow longer, but for now they're smaller as they start out. So see how this can be described as an increasing or a decreasing pattern.